So at the most basic level, the intricate firing rates and patterns of your uh, brain both determine who you have been, and more importantly, and this is the cool part, who you will become. All of the health courses have talked about neuroplasticity, right? The idea that who you are currently as a human being, how your brain functions, how you handle stuff emotionally, how you handle stuff physically, is not fixed. You are more adaptable than we've ever believed possible. And this is, again, one of the things we're going to talk a lot about in this class. The information around neuroplastic change in the brain continues to evolve. Um, I was reading a study just uh, last night, and they were looking at neuroplastic change within certain areas of the brain, hippocampus primarily, and they found relatively permanent, quote unquote, lasting change in the brain after two hours of stimulation. That was in adult human brains. We used to talk about how fast the brain begins to change, we talk about rat studies, etc. We're beyond that, we're going. We see change in an hour, in two hours. And after the two hour mark, we actually see change that is lasting for months at a time. That to me is incredibly cool. You're not fixed. You don't have to be this way or stay this way, but what we do have to do, as Ryan was saying in his introduction, he goes, sometimes it's like we chip away and we get people better and then something else crops up and then something else crops up. So sometimes we have to target more specifically the area that needs to change. Because otherwise, our whole idea, right, and threat neuromatrix, that when there's an ongoing problem, the brain may choose different areas of the body to give you a complaint about, um, that can crop up. So we'll get, we'll get into that. So, most basic level, all human change represents changes in that individual's nervous system, all that we are is brain-derived. 